what is going on guys today we're going to be doing this really unique plugin called reputation so this is really good for rpg servers and it creates like a whole little reputation system on your server so if you're good on your server and then you'll have a good reputation if you're bad on your server then you'll have a bad one and by having a good reputation is killing evil mobs so like skeletons creepers zombies those kind of things but to have a bad reputation means killing players and npcs and also killing farm animals like pigs and cows and stuff like that so if you're good you will have a good reputation you don't have to worry about anything there are seven different tiers so we start off at the basic tier so slash rep will show me what tier I'm at and that is resident so I'm a resident and you can work your way up to become a higher tier based on how many points you get for doing good things or bad things and also if I'm a higher tier and I kill someone with the lower tier then I'm gonna get punished even worse Anyways, go ahead and download this plugin, drop in your plugins folder, and then restart your server, and let's go ahead and get started. You can also change almost about anything in the config, like how many points you get for, let's say, hitting a bad mob or killing a bad mob. You can also disable the scoreboard on the right that's right there. Also shows you your reputation. It also shows you what tier you're in if you type in chat, so it shows I'm a resident. All right, so let's say if I kill Bobby, let's go ahead and do that real quick. Bam, there we go. I'm set back at negative 70 now. So that is my current reputation. So let's try to make it a little bit better just by doing good things. And good things are killing evil mobs. So let's kill some evil mobs. Here's one of them. And we're about to kill the zombie. Now we're at negative 65. So I only got five points from killing that zombie. And you can change how many points you get from killing bad mobs in the config, like I said and yeah so let's go ahead and continue on also this works really well with citizens if you have that plugin what that plugin is it allows npcs which are just like stationary bot people so if you kill those people then your reputation will also go down all right i was able to kill that so it went down to 61. all right so this will take me a little while but this leads to me showing that you guys can manually set a player's reputation with slash rep set the player's name and then how many points you want them to have so let's go with 300 so now I'm at 300 and my reputation tier is still a resident all right so let's change that I want to be a higher tier let's go to 3000 okay so there we go you have now become a well-respected counselor so our reputation is that high you can also just add points or subtract points with slash rep and the player's name Let's say you just want to take away 10 points because you don't know how high the reputation is. You can just do that. So there we go. Now I've just been demoted to a respected citizen. All right. So in the config YML inside the plugins floor, there's a couple things you can change. What worlds this is enabled in, whether it uses the prefix, whether like the tier shows up as a prefix in the chat, what plugins you want to work with this. So if you want a scoreboard to work with this, you can type in true. If you want world guard to work with this and citizens, you can type in true if you want. And then just things that happen whenever they move down a tier or up a tier. So keep in mind there are tiers if you move very far down. So let's say you're at negative 1,000. That is a tier as well, just in case you guys didn't know. And then how many points they have to be to be at this tier. So 1,000 points. You can change that as well. And then as you guys can see, if you hit a player, you lose 5. If you hit a pet, you lose 5. If you hit a citizen or kill a citizen, you lose 25. If you give food, you get 10. If you hit a player or kill a player, you get 50 that's if you're at the negatives anyways here are the mobs and how many points you get for killing one and so yeah that's it for this plugin tutorial hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did make sure to drop a like i love this plugin hopefully you guys do too if you're new make sure to subscribe i'll see you guys in my next video peace out